Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. And of course, guys, I'm going to show you to fix the issue where MMS won't send problem on the Galaxy S10. And this applies to any Galaxy S10, including S10, E, S10, S10 Plus. And by MMS, I mean the built-in messenger app that sends multimedia messages on your device. All right, so let's go straight into it. Now, the first thing I wanted to try, guys, if you're having the problem where you are not um, able to send out MMS messages, it can be several reasons. I'm going to look at a possibility of eight solutions. All right, guys, the first thing I want to try is just go to uh, messages. And once you're in the messages up, I want to look around. And you'll notice right up here, there are three dots right beside the search. Let's go ahead and tap. Once you tap those, um, the three dots, I want to go over to configuration messages and once you're in here you should notice that there is a bunch of messages here that says configuration messages now these messages are actually pushed to your um, device by your carrier um, if they have not been pushed to your device as yet or this section is empty just go ahead and call your carrier and ask them to push these settings to your device you're gonna come back here are you gonna see them on screen and what you're gonna do here is just look for the one that says MMS and of course, these are configuration messages. They automatically add the settings that's needed to your phone. So let's go ahead and tap. And once you tap, it should start configuring the messages to install. All right. So you can also go ahead and install any others that you see. As it this, for example, the second one says um, browser is related to the internet and will help the setup of the internet. All right. But the key one is the MMS. So you're just going to go ahead and use the configuration messages. And once you do that, your MMS should start working. All right, the next thing you can try, guys, again, um, is you're going to go back to messages once more. Once in messages, again, you're going to tap on the three dots right beside the search right there. And once you do that, you're going to go over to um, this time settings. Once you're in settings, guys, let's go ahead and you're going to hit on um, more settings. Once you're in more settings, just look around, you should see text messages. Go ahead and tap text messages and you're gonna look all the way down here where it says message center and of course your message center is a special number that's used to um handle incoming and outgoing uh, messages if this number is incorrect it's gonna prevent your messages from being sent effectively so just go ahead guys and um look if there's anything there if not just call your carrier again and ask them for your center number or message center number and here you can search it for it online as well and of course, you're going to enter the correct number. Make sure the number is correct as well. If there's an error in the number, it will not receive or send effectively. And you can actually go ahead and change the um, numbers here or edit them to your liking. Once that's okay, just go ahead again and try to send your MMS. All right. Another thing that can affect your MMS messages, guys, is your mobile data. Now, mobile data, as it relates to your ability to browse the internet, um, if you're only using Wi-Fi, you have to make sure that your um, MMS messages are set up um, in terms of your connections and just make sure that your data connection is set up uh, that you can browse the mobile network as if that setting is not working you won't be able to send MMS messages so you cannot depend on Wi-Fi alone you'll need your mobile network to be set up and be functional um, you can know it's working um, as you can use your data um, your data on the go from your mobile carrier so once that's working you should be good to go if not you'll have to set up your mobile data that's um the third thing that you can try next thing you can try guys is this time you're going to try to reset network settings to do that go into settings once in settings scroll down to general management once under general management go to reset once in reset guys you're going to reset network settings sometimes you have corrupted settings and these can actually cause your device not to work as they should so you're going to tap on reset network settings should ask for your password once you hit reset but of course it will only uh, reset stuff related to wi-fi mobile data and bluetooth you will might in most cases have to reconnect to your wi-fi network and so on but doing this in some cases should fix the issue for you let's go ahead and reset network settings all right guys so after that if that did not work as well you can try the next step the next thing you can do guys is restart your phone now um there are two ways to do it. you can go ahead and restart our power off and of course there's also the method of holding down power and volume down which should reforce which should force restart the device 
or that should replicate the battery pull method so you can actually do this one just hold on power and volume down hold and then of course when you see the samsung logo let go by doing this it should reset your device and in some cases it should fix minor issues as it relates to sending mms as it might just be a device issue as the device has been on too long another thing to do guys is to clear message cache to do that it's simple to clear the cache of your messages just go to settings next go to apps I got to search for messages you can actually use the search function up here and search of course everything is alphabetically arranged all right you're gonna go to messages once in messages guys um and of course i just forgot make sure you go back and back up your messages or if you do not uh, mind losing your messages just proceed but again you will lose your data or your messages if you continue so just go to storage and of course clear cache which is this option here so you're just gonna go ahead and clear cache and of course if you don't want to lose your messages just stop here go back and see if it's working but of course you'll get more effect out of clearing data but do remember that clearing data will erase um, your messages so just go ahead and clear data and if you're backed up you should be good and of course after this you can go back you can restart your device and when you come back just go ahead and try to send your enemies again next thing to try guys is to clear the cache partition to do this you'll have to boot into Android recovery. I have a separate um, video tutorial on that. I'll link to it right here on screen. You can click and find the um, message, um, find the um, procedure in order to do this step. Also, please go down into the description. I'll also have it in the description. A link to the video as well. Finally, if all has failed, you can also try to reset your phone. You'll have to back up your device. Um, do use this one with caution as it will erase everything off your device. And of course, you're gonna go down to um, settings and this time you're gonna go to general management once in general management go over to um, reset and the reset here to use in this case is factory and data reset so stop follow the on-screen instruction and you should reset your device and finally guys you can also call your carrier you can call your carrier and see if they're having any issue with your network also if they are not having any issue with their network they might also be able to do something from their side to fix the problem. Alright guys, this is Ricardo Garner from Block Tech Tips showing you how to fix issues with the MMS won't send problem on the Galaxy S10. So Ricardo saying bye until next time. Bye.